Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for a wild ride. Today we're diving into the riveting world of copyright law and artificial intelligence, and trust me, this is a story you won't want to miss. We're talking about Musk, Tesla, and the producers of Blade Runner 2049 clashing in a courtroom over AI-generated images. Sounds like a sci-fi plot, right? Picture this. It's October 10th, 2024. Elon Musk unveils his concept for a robotaxi, the Cybercab, on the Warner Brothers lot. And what's on display? An image strikingly similar to a scene from Blade Runner 2049. Sounds cool, but here's where it gets serious. Alcon Entertainment, which produced the film, wasn't happy about it. Alcon claims that Tesla used images from Blade Runner 2049 without permission after they vehemently denied the request to use their material. Instead of backing off, Tesla allegedly turned to AI to generate a similar image. It's a classic case of if you can't have it, just create something that looks like it. But can they get away with that? The AI-generated image in question featured a man in a trench coat overlooking a devastated, orange-lit city, mirroring a critically acclaimed scene from the film. But here's the kicker. Alcon asserts that this was a blatant misappropriation of their brand. Can you believe that? Imagine someone using your work to sell their product without your consent. During the event, Musk openly referenced Blade Runner and remarked, I love Blade Runner, but I don't know if we want that future. What a statement, right? But this raises questions. Did he intend to link his Robotaxi to the film? And if so, what does that say about the brand integrity of Blade Runner? Alcon's lawsuit not only points to copyright infringement, but also accuses Musk of false endorsement. Here's the thing. When someone uses your brand, it can influence how people view it. In this case, they argue that Musk's controversial political views could tarnish Blade Runner's image. That's some serious damage control. Alcon's concern doesn't just revolve around the image itself. It encompasses Musk's behavior. They believe that any brand linking up with Tesla needs to be wary of Musk's outspoken style, which sometimes borders on controversial. They flatly refuse to associate their iconic film with Musk's unpredictable behavior. Let's break this down a little. We all want to be creative and inspired by films that move us. But using something as iconic as Blade Runner without a nod to the original creators opens up a larger conversation about creative rights in the digital age. It's not just Elon Musk versus Alcon. It's about the future of creativity and copyright. In the midst of all this, consider the themes of Blade Runner 2049, which explores artificial intelligence and our future. Isn't it ironic that the very technologies we develop, like AI, are becoming tools for both creation and legal battles? It's like something out of a futuristic movie. And what about public opinion? Social media has exploded with reactions to this lawsuit. Many are taking sides. Some support Musk's innovative spirit, while others believe he should respect the original content. How do you feel about it? Would you side with the big tech giant or the studio preserving its legacy? Imagine sitting around a cafe with friends discussing this very issue. Some may argue that ideas should be free, while others protect the rights of creators. It creates a rich debate about artistic expression and the boundaries of inspiration. That's what makes this case so fascinating. And let's not forget about Musk's own social media antics. After the lawsuit was filed, he simply tweeted, that movie sucked. Seriously, talk about stirring the pot. His flippant attitude could potentially backfire legally. It seems like there's no filter. Now, exploring the communication that happened the day before the event is crucial. Alcon claims they were contacted by Warner Brothers for permission to use Blade Runner imagery just hours prior. They promptly declined, signaling trouble ahead. Was this a strategic move or a mere oversight? Think about it. Sci-fi influences how we see our future and advancements in AI. Blade Runner was a landmark film that has shaped our culture. That said, does using AI to recreate those images stand in defiance of the principles established by the original creators? Ever since the rise of AI, we've watched technology monetize creativity more than ever. But as we progress, we must ensure that creativity is respected. Companies like Tesla are pushing boundaries while balancing the fine line of innovation and respect for intellectual property. As this legal drama unfolds, it invites a closer examination of how tech and creativity blend in today's world. Legal battles may seem dry, but the impact on our culture and future creativity is anything but boring. It's something we should actively engage with. With time running out, this case could set a precedent. How will courts define the boundaries of AI-generated content? It affects not only Tesla and Alcon, but every creator out there. The implications are massive and far-reaching. As we discuss these ideas, I want to hear from you. How do you feel about this evolving landscape? Do you think companies like Tesla should have the freedom to draw inspiration from iconic films without getting permission? What about innovation? Companies are constantly innovating and looking for inspiration. But as they reach for the stars, they must also tether themselves to the ground rules established by laws and ethical standards. Finding that balance is key. Keep in mind, a CEO's personal perspective can drastically affect their company's brand. How Musk's personal brand interacts with Tesla's innovation is crucial for consumers' perception. 
That's why Alcon is playing their cards carefully. In the future, we'll likely see these types of cases more frequently as AI continues to evolve. So many fascinating technologies are at our fingertips, but with great power comes great responsibility, especially in creative fields. Let's not forget, this lawsuit reflects deeper questions about the direction we take as a society. As we craft our future with AI, we must respect the art that has inspired many. Where do we go from here? It's something worth pondering. The creative process has always had its challenges, crossing boundaries with new tools. We have to embrace change while protecting the very essence of what makes creativity special. It's a juggling act, but one worth exploring. And how about fan art? Many people take inspiration and reinterpret iconic works. It fosters a community of creativity, but there's a fine line between homage and infringement. It's a conversation that must keep evolving. Should there be more collaboration between tech innovators and creative industries? There's undeniable potential for synergy. When these worlds collide, all parties can benefit, but only if mutual respect is established. So, let's unite the tech and creative communities. By having these conversations, we can ensure that creativity continues to thrive in an innovative world. We need each other now more than ever. And as we ponder the future of AI and creativity, let's keep an eye on what's around the corner. Alcon versus Tesla is just one battle in the ongoing war to define our creative landscape. It's illuminating and, honestly, downright thrilling to watch. This case pushes us to critically examine our relationship with technology and the stories we love. Each of us can learn from this and be empowered as stewards of creativity. Your insights really matter. Before we wrap up, I truly appreciate your time spent here today. Your thoughts, feelings, and engagement are what drive this channel forward. Let's build a thriving community where ideas flourish and everyone's voice counts. Whether you idolize Musk or see his impulsiveness as problematic, this journey raises essential discussions about where we're headed. We shouldn't lose sight of the creative legacies that inspire us all. In conclusion, the crossroads of technology and creativity is an exciting place filled with potential for diverse voices. As we navigate the future, your involvement and understanding will be paramount. Let's bridge these worlds together. Thank you for exploring this thought-provoking topic with me today. Your support means everything, and I'm committed to delivering top-notch content that resonates with you. Let's keep this conversation going.